What's up guys, Dish Gaming here, and you may notice that the previous video, before this one at least, was also Victoria 2. So you're probably wondering why we're on this one again. Well, it is quite a simple answer, dear viewer. God, why did I say it like that? Uh, well, it's quite a simple answer. I went to go record Darkest Hour, and for some reason my recording software refused to record it. So I'll be replacing that with a different series very soon. I'll try it again tomorrow. Well, not tomorrow. Monday, I'll try it again. But if it doesn't work then, I think I'm going to need to replace that with a different series. So I'm thinking either... So I'm thinking either Kerbal Space Program. Thinking Kerbal Space Program, Hearts of Iron 4. Uh, I'm trying to think. Maybe Crusader Kings 2? Uh, it's, mm, mm, I don't really have any DLCs of Crusader Kings 2. I'm warning you guys now. I have, like, Legacy of Rome. That's all I have for CK2. Uh, then there's also, uh, maybe, well, a Kerbal Space Program. I already said that one. Uh, there was another game I was thinking about maybe doing one on. Uh, the, uh, I'm so sorry if I annoy you guys whenever I make that sound. Oh, that's a. Uh, hmm. So I was thinking maybe. I don't know. You guys can leave any suggestion you want in the comments too, if you'd like. I can't guarantee I'll have your suggestions, but. Might <laughs> as some Dutch armies getting crushed over there. So last time we were at war with the British. Completely occupied Canada. For some reason, our war score is going down because some people don't know when to stop attempting to occupy places. Speaking of which, let's get back on the boats now. Clearly, there's too many Brits here for us to stop at this point. So, let's just get back on the boats. You, know what? you stay there. You go dock. Now, get on the boats. Okay. Uh, Maldives are already occupied. Any other small British islands? Can go occupy Madagascar, maybe? Let's go occupy Mar Martinez. How did they get Martinez, but... These are these are both in the same state, yet somehow France got one island and the British got one of the other islands. Which is odd when you think about it, because both those islands were, I think, historically French. I don't know, maybe it's because Madagascar splits? Hmm. I'm losing so much money, though, right now. I mean... We're losing about 2,000 ducats a day. We currently have 22. We have, we're losing about 1,000 a day. We Ducats, yes, totally. Uh, we're losing about 1,000... Hold on one second. I want to see if there's an option for this in the menu. Video. Nope. Uh, uh, we're losing $2,000. <laughs> uh, we're not, I'm not saying pounds ever. Uh, so we're losing about $1,000. A day, but we have about 22 million in reserve, so I think we'll be fine for right now. Meanwhile, we are fighting a battle on Martinus. Martinus, yeah. German Tanzania, or sorry, Tangranica. I wonder, does this have for any country, or specifically Germany? Because I know Germany historically held that area, so I didn't know if maybe. Uh, what? Peru is getting rebels. Let's see. Peru, what, how bad is the rebel situation? Where is your army? Where is your army? I'm oh, probably occupying stuff for me. Okay, very well. Uh, can I march straight down there? Yes, I can. Let's go help Peru out with these militant socialists. <sighs> Do the Brits know that nobody likes them? I, I seriously want to know. Do, do they know that? 
Oh, we can go occupy, um... We can go occupy Cyprus when we're done. Iraq, 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 Iraq. Oh, yeah, Iraq. You know, if this works, we might be able to prevent the whole Iraqi war in about 100 years. Oh, wait, Iraq got Kuwait as well? Interesting. I didn't think they would get that, but mm, I guess since they have a core there, they get it. Yay, no Kuwait crisis. Yay, no Kuwait thing where Iraq invades Kuwait. That's going, that, that's actually pretty good. General Eugene Cadwell. Okay. Finish there. Let's go occupy, uh, Cyprus now. Soviet Union is formed, but there's reactionaries all over the country. They're just falling apart at the seams here. The Germans, you know, just using a t giant army and not maybe, oh, I don't know, trying to invade England. It would really be slightly helpful there, mate. Just just a little. You know. Just a little bit, man. I can't physically invade England. I, I it's entertaining maybe invading Ireland. Can you walk from or can you walk from Shetland to Orkney? Oh, those are one province. Might be able to walk onto that province then. Damn it. Good, you're on the boats. To Cyprus! Trying to dismantle the British Empire, it's not easy. Uh. Hmm. Acquire Cairo and acquire Colonial Manitoba. I'm kind of hoping we can get a good amount of these states here, just due to the fact that, um,. Just due to the fact that, uh, we do our proximity to the British. And the fact that we're, that if we win this, the British Empire is getting dismantled. Uh. Stop engaging them in areas where you can't win. Come on, guys. Uh, I'm tempted to just, the next time we fight the British, I'm tempted to just go, like... You know what? Only me in Germany. That's it. Props do not grow themselves, sadly. Imagine if they did, though. Imagine how great life would be. We have good relations with the Ottomans. We've all I have a good relation with the Ottomans. I've always had a good relation with the Ottomans. I'm sorry. No, we still have about 104 years until that man becomes president, so... 105, actually. Roughly. So I'm noticing the Soviets are getting max rebel mass rebels. It's too bad that the um uh what was it? The Hearts of Iron Darkest Hour wasn't working. It really is I actually wanted to see how the world would have ended up because of that treaty. Cause the British the Germans never got the Soviets to surrender first, therefore make all these states become independent. So Germany just kind of lost land. Germany actually still, no, they don't directly hold Danzig in that game. If you remember, they like hold like Chuchel basically. They have, like a very thin corridor now. It looks very interesting, to say the least. We've won the battle of the Palestinian coast. Oof! I didn't expect the thirty thousand men to be well. Look okay, at now, it is a three-province thing. Uh, what are those? Jacobins, 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 Bulgarian. Wait, what? <laughs> Gary is still a satellite of the... Uh, mm. Okay, they got Malta. Mm. What happened to each... Oh, yes, that's right. Everybody started killing them. So I guess the Ottomans just took Erecleon in that whole mass murdering of the Egyptians. Why don't we see if we can maybe go occupy some of the land? Do we still occupy the Channel Islands? Uh, yes, we do. We still occupy the Channel Islands, or somebody on our side occupies the Channel Islands. It's like the British Isles themselves are, is what we can't take. Come on, Isle of Man being separate? Yes. 
Let's go take the Isle of Man. I understand why they're mobilized, though. I mean, we're not mobilized, and we're doing perfectly fine here. Maybe it gives them peace of mind knowing that nobody will land in their lands. We still hold... Still hold Gibraltar. May need to go back to, um... The U.S. soon, you know, dock up, re, rebuild, re, um, resupply our men, all that type of stuff. So, you know, we'll just stop in, um, in the Irish Sea. Hello, chap. Top of the morning to you, laddies. My name is Jack Septic Guy. <laughs> that just came out naturally, though. I was just like, hello, chap. Oh, what? We should win this battle. It's two ships versus 84. We should win this. If we don't, I'll be very disappointed in these ships right here. Might even go to... The Irish are trying to rise up. Come on, Irish! You can do it! I mean, I know they have about 600,000 men on Ireland for some reason. If they have so many men, why aren't they trying to, um... I don't know, maybe you land in Germany. Oh, because Germany also has a ton of men. Though, interestingly, I'm noticing, looking at this whole island over here, and I'm noticing that, um, I'm noticing there's a bit of a lack of troops in there. Faroe Islands want an alliance. Sure thing, boy. I wonder, do the Faroe Islands have a core in Orkney and Shetland? Nope, but Scotland does. Oh, that's another thing. If we dismantle the British Empire, Scotland becomes independent. Let's see how many men are all over the, uh, are on the, um, island of Britain. Maybe, might be able to land on Britain itself, but... Just, just, just ignore these men here. Uh, they need to resupply, though, so badly. Infiltration. We really need to resupply these men. Though, landing in the British Isles would vastly help us out here. That's, a, like, if we can land in the UK itself. Let's land in Liverpool. American troops are storming the beaches. Oh, damn. They dead now, mate. They're dead now, mate. They're gonna die now. Did they? Did they seriously put all their men in Ireland? I swear, if this is true, I'm going to like flip, like do a flip or something. Nope, 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 Retreat, 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 retreat. That army might be dead. That army's probably gonna be dead. Retreat! You can probably hear my frantic clicking trying to get them out of there. Retreat! Uh, we just suffered a loss. And, and then the Germans were just like, right after that loss, the Germans were like, you know what? I'm done with this war. Peace. Literally, that's what they did. They just peaced out. Mm. I really wanted to see the British Empire dismantled, too. Oh, well. Uh, what do people want the most? Safer working conditions. Limited safety regulations. That was another thing I remember saying last episode. We're giving um colonies home rule. Plot just replaces the colony. Let's release them. Western Tower. So they shall have home rule now. Okay. I was like, okay, this like, what? I was like, oh no, I saw the satellite thing after. So we have Gavin, Liberia, and Western Tower are all going to be granted, are all granted home rule now. Cause I know I'm never gonna build troops there, so. 
No point in keeping them directly under our control if we're never gonna help them or anything. <sighs> Damn Brits. Why is this running so much slower than usual? <laughs> I wish Canada would just petition for annexation already. They, they know they want to. They know they want to become officially part of the U.S. We let them pretend to have independence. What other? There was a ton of other countries released. Really. Uh, no, yeah, Panama is not becoming a dominion under us anytime soon. Along with the United States of America. Hmm. Rio Grande. We could release Rio Grande in one province. There we go. Then we'll make Alaska a satellite now. Nah, actually, you not. Know I might have actually done that. We gained Medicine Hat as a core. That's such a weird province name. I don't even know what to do with that. <laughs> I really would just wish I could just annex, like. South Ontario, you know, just I wish I could just micromanage puppets. That would be so awesome. Just like change where puppets locations are. Oh, I thought South Carolina was merged with North Carolina this time instead of Georgia. That was always so weird. Why would they be merged with Georgia in the base game? Uh, Iraq. Welcome to the American Spear. American Coast Prosperity Spear. Let's make it happen, mate. Let's make it happen. <laughs> Kamachta. I am seriously getting tired of France this shit with Brazil. <laughs> Tanner Tuva? Oh yeah, Tanner Tuva has existed for a while. They've just been a puppet of, um... They've just been a puppet of the king. For ages. The king themselves. Wait. The king annexed uh, Manchuria. Oh, cool. The king themselves are under the puppets. Are, pup are in the spear of Italy. But everything else, except for these parts, are in the sphere of Japan. Which is very weird, because I think Japan used to have Manchuria. I think that's why. So it's sort of all been like one connected landmass, kind of. Including the fact that they directly own Korea. How many does Iraq have? Okay. Do you have cores on Khuzestan by any chance? You have cores on some of Khuzestan. What about Alam? Nope, that's Kurdistan. We demand you release Kurdistan. Do it. Now. <laughs> Brazil. What, what, how's it hanging, my dude? Uh... Um, no, it's not you, it's Argentina. Argentina's got those, mate. Uh, you need to go back home now. Mm. So many troops that are under my command. You, go merge with that army. There's no point in having you two to be separate, but equal. No, no just separate. Oh, 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 that is interesting. They decided to release Newfoundland. Don't mind me here. Don't no. Don't pay attention to a Briton. It's it's not important. <laughs> just just pay no mind to me, Britain. Just pay no attention. Oh, Russia's back. Hi, Russia. Just, just don't pay attention to what I'm doing in Newfoundland, Britain. Just don't. They aren't actually influencing them, though, which is the funny part here. And you know what? Lebanon's actually not in our sphere, but they're probably going. They're going to be very soon. So let's just let's just work on Newfoundland here.
Who? The Japanese are conquering Russian Sakhalin. Oh no, Russia, what are you gonna do, mate? They're conquering Sakhalin from you. That's part of Russian Sakhalin? I guess just simulate a more accurate, um, Ru Russo Japanese war. You're gonna get in my sphere and you're gonna like it, Newfoundland. I always say, like, New Finland when it's Newfoundland. Hopedale, Northwest River. Uh, yeah, I can just see a majority of their provinces because a lot of them are bordering Canada. Who's already my puppet, so, I mean, I would say if they get in my sphere, I should be able to merge them with Canada. You know, just get the two together. I remember the one war we had to fight Canada. Those are dark days. Socialist in my Canada? Funny part is it literally is my Canada as well. It's nobody else's Canada but mine. I wonder, is there a potential we could pull them from being a, you know, a satellite? Or, sorry, I, I think they would just be a Dominion. Yeah, Dominion. I just need to declare war on the Danish one day just for, um, these islands up here, the subarctic islands. I don't really want Pharaoh anyways. It's a good thing they're independent. You, you're being a good boy. Good boy. Pet, pet. How do we get a presidential dictatorship in one of these guys? These all should have been released as full-blown republics here. Gavin. Gavin's a republic. This guy is somehow a presidential dictatorship. I don't know if I like that, mate. One of the accepted cultures is Yankee and Dixie. Yay. How many Yankees and Dixies are actually in the land, though? That's the good question. That's the true question we need that needs to be asked here. Zero percent. I'm assuming that other one percent is yeah. Oh, this one is that one? No, nope, that's a better one. Okay, so the fascist the reactionaries and the conservatives have all seen a rise in popularity now. The mid-year elections, of course. Uh, let's get planes. <laughs> Shouldn't the Wright brothers have flown, oh, I don't know, 11 years ago? Looking at you. I think it was over here, right? Right, it was over there, right? I think it is. <sighs> mother, mother, they've opened a new store. Nobody cares about your new store, little girl. Oh, World War One supposed to start soon, except, you know. If we were going by that logic, the Baltic War should have started about four years ago, and... Uh, you know, Balkan War would have already happened, and Italy would own the, the Libya. And, you know, Serb the, Serbia would own this as well, Novi Pasar, and... Yeah. This auto... This autonomist. I wonder, is it possible, since I know sometimes stuff people like communists and fascists and whatnot, they can put you in occupy, occupy a certain part of the land for long enough. Like, let's just say some communist rises up in Cameron. Sure, why not? Let's say some communist rises up there. Eventually, I know it's possible for the, um... for them to just declare themselves an independent communist Cameroon. What happens off that if the area that they occupy already exists as like another country? Like this right here. This is um part of Ser this would be Serbia. Or Albania. Might actually be Albania. Because there's a very high Albanian population here. I don't think it was as high as no, about the same Christiana. 
I'm gonna end this video a year early, just, you know, I don't know. Still not feeling so great, I don't know if you guys... I forgot to say why I haven't made a video in a week and a half. I haven't been feeling well the past week and a half. Still not feeling so great, so... I may just end this a little early. Why can't this just be like... It's own pro- Why can't this be like it's own state? I would love to see borders where at least this like- This little random bit here just didn't exist. I was literally just drawn at random. Argentina, still having them damn rebels, aren't you, mate? Argentina, how you doing? You got it, mate. Come on, you got it. I'm not surprised Argentina never got this. Didn't Paraguay also own Macho Grosso, though? Maybe they didn't. Maybe they did, maybe they didn't. I don't remember. But, yeah, Paraguay and Chacho, though, needs to go to the real Chachos. I don't think that makes any sense. We got Fort Vermillion as a core. And the Dutch want an ally. Of course. We are one of our best cities wouldn't exist if it weren't for you. Boxers attack American legislation. We can go put down the Boxer Rebellion. Force disarmament and war reps. Well, did the boxers take over? Is that what they're trying to say? Oh, okay. It's not just us. Okay. It calls in each person separately, I guess. So, where are the rest of our ships? Where's the majority of our navy? Where is our navy? Did we leave it here? Are you kidding me? Is this our entire navy? Yeah, no, yeah, that would be it. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Let's get an outfit with some battleships now. Let's get a bunch of steam transports and let's outfit the rest. Never mind. Cruisers. Oh, got a. Get rid of a bunch of cruisers. There. We're gonna have a bunch of battleships now in the Navy, too. So, that's still run a point for Navy, right? Yes. It turns out I didn't realize that. So, yeah. Awesome. Is Ulaanbaatar their capital here? Ulaanbaatar. Damn king. Mm, 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 mm. I not all the ones trying to get to Japan because some of them were in their spear. Might have to be able to white piece out with the with these guys. Depending since there's a ton of people. All forcing them to pay for the boxer's crime. Wasn't that about 14 years ago? Shouldn't we be in the middle of the, um... Lebanon. Lebanon, 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 Lebanon. Have our advisors been expelled from... The hell is Lebanon? Oh, may help here. Lebanon, add the spear. Hmm. So as I said earlier, I think I'm going to end this in um, 18, in 1915 rather than the usual 1916. It means the next episode will be a bit longer. Plus side. Of five years of episode rather than four. Also, we're already at half an hour, and I really don't want to go through a whole nother year, so. Maybe Japan can get take Taiwan in this, or sorry, Formosa in this. Uh, but Japan isn't really doing that well. Newfoundland. 
Oh. Ha 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 ha. Too late, Brits. Damn Brits. Mm. There's a reason I'm not pursuing Japan right now. They just don't seem to know. Why isn't the. Well, shouldn't you all be going to the rendezvous point? I thought it was set. Uh. Whatever. Where are all our ships spawning? We got some there. Some nation there. We have a ton of troops in the middle of like Mex Me Mexico and whatnot. That voice crack though. Uh, any of them on the west coast? Uh, two ships there. Four there. Is that it? Two more in the middle of goddamn Alaska. Eh. I think that's it. Okay. And then you two armies were supposed to combine. Hmm. I'm fine with that. Oh, damn Japan. God damn, it's supposed to be Russian land, and Japan was just like, well, nope, I'm taking it. <laughs> the land is usually would usually go to Russia, but nope, Japan is like, nah, mate, I got this. Yeah. Must protect freedom of trade to not be abridged anyway. Uh, I don't know if you guys go on Reddit at all. There is a subreddit for this channel now. It's not popular at all. But. But I mean, you know, I just wanted the subreddit for the name of this channel to be under the control of me, so that, that way I don't, I don't have it under some random person watching this video, you know. So the subreddits are Dish Gaming if you guys want to go check it out, but, man. Why won't the... French ever learn that trying to steal people from my spear just doesn't work, right? It just doesn't. Meanwhile, we got Newfoundland, you know, who we're all friendly with, and like, yo, you should really join Canada, mate. <laughs> I wish it, I wish we could do that. I wish we could just force Newfoundland to join Canada if they're both in our spear. Like, that would just grow our influence without a war or anything. Oh, speaking of which. Crisis. Fun. Well, that's going to have to wait for next episode. So this is the end of the episode, guys. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, subscribe, whatever. And I will stop. What? I'll see you guys. I'll be back Monday. Thanks for watching. Bye.